surface and it's pushed towards an object. While this technique may have worked for a short scene, Cameron had to find a more natural way to film longer underwater scenes in Avatar 2. The way of water connects all things. So he literally had the cast train with free divers in Hawaii for months. They learned special techniques to hold their breath for several minutes and stay calm. We did work with, with world-renowned free divers that train Navy SEALs. In fact, some of the actors set records on set with Sigourney Weaver doing a breath hold for six and a half minutes and Kate Winslet holding her breath for seven minutes and 15 seconds. And to help them move faster and more efficiently when needed, the actors had jetpacks strapped to their hands. They also had underwater scooters that looked like rideable aquatic creatures. Behind, behind Avatar, Avatar is, is equally mind-blowing. Mind James Cameron built a gigantic pool in the studio that could hold 3.4 million liters or 900,000 gallons of water. That's almost one and a half Olympic swimming pools or 18,927 bathtubs. It uses a specifically configured Sony Venice camera with a 3D stereoscopic beam splitting system. Then, to capture the action on the water surface, he used mocap cameras mounted on the ceiling above the pool. And for the underwater scenes, a large number of special motion capture cameras were built and mounted inside the pool. But there was one last issue. The cameras were having a hard time focusing on the white motion trackers on the actors' suits. So they filled the surface of the pool with thousands of white opaque balls. This helped cut the light reflections in the water without obstructing the actors from reaching the surface whenever they wanted. Avatar The Way of Water was finally brought to life by VFX House Weta Digital. And one thing's for certain, this film will not only break records once again, it will also transform the future of underwater filming and motion capture.